advanced life support provider Henti Milan, stationed at the Fairview Fire Station, says one has to be passionate about people to survive in his line of work. He and his team put their own lives in danger in response to various calls which involve serious life-threatening injuries. We deal with these things. Um, it is sometimes a big problem to deal with the public itself. Sometimes they do want to get violent, but then as soon as we see our safety is in, in jeopardy, we leave. It is his job to guide his team in stabilizing the patient for transportation to the hospital while trying to keep both the victim and his team calm. He's seen it all and takes it all in his stride, but says the worst for him are calls that affect children. Those are the little things that sticks in my mind. and it, You try to forget about it, but it just stays there. Because I'm a father, um, children is something that's close to my heart. And that is something that you don't forget when children get injured. Before a call, we, we must um, prepare ourselves, our equipment and everything. So I know precisely where everything is, so I don't search for anything. So, so when I treat someone, I can directly get what I want and so on. When you're the first at Lebanon's life support paramedic, uh, you have to take the scene over and, and from actually find out what happened and completely take control of the scene. And sometimes, um, sometimes there's multiple patients and, and it, could be, it can be quite stressful, especially being a student, because uh, you've got your supervisor behind you helping you and so on, but it's still, it's still a lot of stress, because with experience you, 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 deal to, you learn to deal with the nerves. This is all in a day's work for the brave men and women of Fairview. Sebaba Tomasamo, Eyewitness News, Fairview Fire Station. Eyewitness News, in touch, in tune and independent. For the latest, log on to ewn.co.za or ewn.mobi.